As soon as I got him in my arms, when I looked at him, immediately my heart kind of sank. Well, thank you for finding her. He was just like, please, someone take me. Because it was 100 degrees, too. He just allowed to be picked up, and he wasn't moving. So it's worse than I thought. Thank you. We thought that he was a female because he was so malnourished and he had already been neutered. She has a low temperature right now. Probably his family moved away, left him outside, and he was left to defend for himself, and that's why he was so skinny. We had the abscess on his forehead looked at. We started him on some antibiotics. It was that feeling of, finally, someone's taking care of me. I'm going to get better. It's OK. We're going to help now. For the first day, he was very weak. He was very dehydrated. It's OK, we started giving him sub fluid injections, and once the hydration started, he was still shaky, but he would stand up to eat. Hi, Valentine. How you doing? How you doing? Um, he just wanted to give everyone an update and let everyone know he's doing good, responding well to the antibiotics. Inflammation is basically completely gone. He just needs to grow some hair back now. <laughs> he's gaining weight. He's getting stronger. He's got new hair growing back. As soon as that started to heal, he started to form a connection with us on like a different level. He became almost like a different cat. His personality changed to this, I love you guys. <laughs> Every time we pick him up, he would start rubbing his face on our face and really saying thank you, I feel like. And then he likes to give kisses too, so he'll kiss my nose. He's a lover. I believe the infection on his face has completely cleared up. Top is good. When I first saw his little baby hairs growing back, it was really exciting. He grew it back within a matter of weeks. What are you guys doing? Hey, now we get some fresh air. Hey, Valentino. When we hold him, he never leaves you. He'll sit on you until you have to get him. Valentino! <laughs> That's too much! <laughs> he wants you to be with him 100% of the time. Obviously, we're busy, so we have a lot of other kitties to care for. So he's going to be looking for a home, but it's going to have to be, obviously, the perfect home for him. Someone that's home a lot, spends a lot of time with him, will be able to hold him a lot of the time. He will love to be with someone where he gets 100% of the attention. Good night from this little man. Hey, good night, Belle. He found us, and we're going to find him a great home, too. Let's see what Valentino's doing. Hey, Val. Hey, what are you doing? What are you doing, sweetie?